Aloha everyone. This is Imelda from Imelda's Jungle. Oh, today, today I have to do a recycling with this. Um, this is the um the socks of rice the bags of rice and I have to recycle it and I have to plant uh, potatoes on this and uh, this bags is Hinori Hinori rice but I'm not sponsored by them and the potting soil that I will use is Miracle Girl. Same thing, I'm not sponsored by them. So, my project for today is growing this on the bed. Um, this plant, I also uh, growing this plant in a recycle um, what is that drinks holder it's a uh, how do you call that i'm not good at that and i wrap it that's the holder for the cup when you you, you bought um drinks outside and the uh, fast foods and I have an assistant gardener here but he's watching to catch a bird he's my tiger boy look <laughs> why what's happened to you why you almost flip over be careful now Okay, we're we're going back to our potato. These potatoes were organic. They're they're the one that we can buy in Safeway, the organic potatoes for cooking. And I. I'm growing them using this um, the cup holder, both of it, and I wrap it with a garbage bag. And my other seed is there. Actually, it's not the whole potato. I uh, usually cut them for trees so that I can have a lot and I don't need to spend a lot of my money but somebody eat it mm, I'm doubting it's uh, the mongoose because mongoose is visiting my garden and they love eating all those I think they don't have that so, um, I already filled up the bags with the soil, so we have to plant the individual potatoes right now. So I'll take this out from. It's so easy to take it out. Just lift this up. And as you can see, the root is to establish. So it's good using that one. But the only thing using the... I don't need to spend money for the disposable um, cup holder from the from the uh, fast foods when you bought 
a drink. So I just wrap it with a rubbish bag, the one we're using for the the bags for rubbish cans. Then so as you can see here again the roots were so established and this is more better to have like this because the roots is there and that means that you don't need uh, the the plant will not struggle again because you you ruin their their roots they need that so that they can just continue um, growing so we continue with uh, with what we have to do so this is the bag and I only put uh, one no it's um, more than one fourth of the bag I, I put um I filled up with soil it's a one fourth of the height of the bag and I have to put this I have to just dig a little bit just grab a small amount of soil and we'll check the the, the the plant first so that's the way I I cut the I think I divided the plant on oh no, the tuber of uh, potato for four so it's successful of saving money so I just put in there I don't dig far more deeper because uh, I can build with so soil more on this going up just release the one I folded then you can fill up with more with more of the soil as the potato grows up so that's the only thing that you need to do uh, to do so no special stuff that i need to do then the only thing after this i had to feed them the good nutrients so that they will produce tubers that's the secret and you have to watch them with usually here in Hawaii growing a potato is so uh, frankly speaking as a gardener it's so hard because the one who will attack this first is the white fly and they keep they will leave underneath the the leaves a lot of uh, miserable things will happen in there uh, as soon as they're there so but the only thing I have something that I learn I have to mix up something that I can get it from my kitchen and an organic and I can mix it up and make it into a formulation for spraying and killing this white flies and the bugs and the next that i need to deal with here is the slob and the snails there are a lot of them so as a gardener you're gonna be what's full with them you have to check them every now and then as you're um, just for your leisure time check once in a while if 
nothing is attacking. Usually the slugs and the snails will attack your plants during the night. So before you sleep, try to check them. And we'll do the next plant. We'll just check this out. The other one. So it's so easy, just lift the plant up and you can help the plant and the roots is not growing or destroyed so like that that's the the plant looks actually if i want to save more this one i can mm, cut it into half again and separate these two plants and just use one of it in each bags but for this time i just have to put it in the plant this in the middle okay just easy as that just put in there and cover a little bit because you keep filling this up as the plants will grow you don't have somebody to help you videoing and if possible if you don't need to bother somebody uh, you must have a tripod and I took the third one and this is the way it looks like if I want to save more I can cut this half but right now to my project i have to plant this directly then in your own project you can do that to save more money because this one uh actually the the um, this um it will make more plants that's why it will grow more so if there's a lot of plants in one bag it's not really good because they become like they're uh, like the nutrients that usually you're supporting only plant it goes to it gonna be divided into two so um, but we'll just try so I just um, put in the metal again and cover it then I have to collect the other okay. the one that was attacked by the mongols and eat the inside but it still survived it um, growing up so you don't we don't need to worry with that and this one the the small plants in there that you can see the green one that's the mm, the amaranth i have amaranth here and i have a lot then mm, i don't need to save that so i just use that for fertilizer okay just cover that again and just simple as that cover that <laughs> so that the mongoose the mongoose will not eat it then i'll collect one more one more potato this one is smaller but i think it's already rooted so i just gonna grab it like this then this is the 
the bed. So I just put in the middle and then cover. Cover like that. So it's so easy. Then uh, for me using the cup holder that I have when we bought something from either Pizza Hut or somewhere else in the fast foods um, usually jack in the box then I don't throw it away so I save that for my project and wrap it with a rubbish bag then it's more easier and your plant won't suffer and actually I can reuse that again uh, I have to grow another set of potato so that's the finishing looks of our our plant in a recycled Hinori 15 pounds um, bag of rice so uh, that's the plants oh I forgot I never put it in the deeper one and cover it sorry <laughs> it's so funny ay, ay, ay. so oh uh, look at <clears throat> this one is the biggest one and that one is the smaller and look at that the there's a, a sign already ready that the something is attacking the leaves so as soon as possible I need to spray with my formulation that protect them from the the bugs and uh, the white flies so if you want an update for my um organic potatoes that uh i'm growing it on the hinodi bags a recycled hinodi bags then the one i'm excited about if um, is imelda can help the plants to survive survive from all those bugs and the the snails and mm, the what is the other one the crawling the slugs that's another enemy and I think I will try my best and so please subscribe to my channel if you want an update and ring the bell so that you can be notified by the youtube for um my my videos and please feel free to share it to your family and friends and please I will be happy if you give me a thumbs up. Thank you so much for watching my videos and see you on my next. I love you. Mahalo. Bye bye.